Hello there, welcome to your Wednesday morning weather update from the Met Office. Now through today, it's a chilly start, showers particularly across central and eastern areas, more cloud and rain towards the west, all courtesy of this weak feature here, delivering that cloud and patchy rain and drizzle down towards Wales, as well as the west country uh, through the afternoon, leaving Northern Ireland later. Come Thursday, this feature here will bring more cloud to Scotland, Northern Ireland, eventually the far north of England, as well as Wales, brighter skies further south. However, if you're stepping out first thing this morning, it is chilly outside. Add to that a strong wind across the north and northeast of Scotland with frequent showers. Showers also running down this east coast. Inland, though, some pockets of frost to start the day. At least you'll see some sunshine. The cloud has thickened across Northern Ireland and the Western Isles, and here we'll see some outbreaks of mostly light rain and drizzle. And a legacy of showers continues through the morning across Wales and one or two just pushing down towards the West Country as well as the Channel Islands. However, for the bulk of the country, it's a mostly dry start with some sunshine. These winds will be strongest through the morning across the east and the northeast of Scotland and then the winds will pick up along the east coast of England as we head through the morning into the afternoon coupled with some showers. Clouds will build generally across the country as we head through the day today and we'll see a scattering of showers. More cloud and outbreaks of rain continue across Northern Ireland through the morning and you can see here migrating southwards just clipping the Isle of Man, West Wales down towards the west country later on today. Now for Western Scotland, particularly mainland Scotland you should see some hazy sunshine. Showers become more scattered across central and eastern areas of Scotland and showers will develop across northern England, the Midlands and the southeast. That, those winds though will be strong through the afternoon along the east coast making it feel cold. Inland we could see a 13. So the cloud and the rain tends to ease across Northern Ireland through this evening and overnight, but we will see some wet weather across central and western parts of Wales, as well as the West Country. Eventually, it will clear. And then the bulk of the country under some clearer skies, quiet conditions. And notice these blues just slowly migrating northwards and southwards. Here's some patchy frost before the next system comes in towards the northwest as we head through into Thursday morning. Before that though, if you're stepping out on Thursday morning, like this morning, it's going to be rather chilly, at least though some brighter weather. Quiet conditions with a slight ridge across England and Wales, whereas further north the winds will pick up again on Thursday as this weather system moves down towards eastern counties. A legacy of showers through Friday then across eastern counties before high pressure slowly asserts itself into the weekend from the west. Weak features in terms of cloud and rain always skirting the far north of Scotland. So let's have a look at Thursday in more detail. Thickening cloud brings out breaks of rain. The rain will be persistent across the western side of Scotland. A little bit of rain also for Northern Ireland. That rain pushing in across the central belt by around lunchtime, pushing down towards Cumbria, Northumberland, Lancashire and Yorkshire, and perhaps just clipping Gwynedd as well as Flintshire through the afternoon, uh, Anglesey and the Isle of Man. We hang on to brighter weather across southern counties of England and it will be dry here. And your outlook then through the next few days. So Friday, a few light showers, particularly in the east, and then turning drier for many, but also some chilly nights. I'll see you later.